Hello, this is Cherokee. Very happy today. Reporting in on my daily video diary, Make Your Habit Strong. Cherokee, make your habit strong. Alright, so today is my Tuesday post. Today is Tuesday, July 27th. And... I don't know how much I have to report in. <laughs> I did want to talk about my food choices for today, which were goodish. I think again, I, I did not have breakfast, but at least I had my tea. Uh, had an unexpected meeting this morning, and I didn't eat my breakfast. I really need to eat breakfast at home, so I'm ready for anything, you know. But anyway, I'm still struggling to, to bring breakfast back into my life after doing a two month fast. Um, so, it was like a spiritual fast, it wasn't, yeah, and part of it was uh, just eating once a day. So anyway, I did have my tea. So for lunch, I had sourdough bread, I had very similar lunch to yesterday, uh, sourdough bread, those delicious kumquat tomato things, kamados, and some cucumbers, celery, just made a whole sandwich out of it, and then I had my cherries for dessert again. Cherries for Cherokee. And I think that's it. Oh, and avocados. And that's it. It was delicious. It was yummy. Oh. And I had cheese. Yeah. That was really good. So I will say those combination of ingredients was not the best combination. <laughs> um, it did make something delicious, but the bread was too strong. I think the sourdough bread is a bit too strong for the kumquat tomato hybrid thing. Um, but other than that, uh, I achieved my goals for today, otherwise I wouldn't be making a video. And I just wanted to say, I realized today that there is something to be said for um, feeling the, what is it, what was I trying to say? Like feeling it and doing it anyway. Like if you don't feel like doing something, right, and you do it anyway, and you consistently do the thing that you don't feel like doing, and I'm specifically talking about something that will benefit you. I'm not talking about going to work every day uh, to a job that you don't like. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about, or doing something else, like some other chore or responsibility that you really don't like. I'm specifically talking about doing something that's beneficial for yourself. And it could be a diet, it could be exercise, it could be learning to play a musical instrument, it could be anything that you really want to do for yourself, right? When you're building a habit, and it is a struggle every day, you have to build it. And anytime you build, there's work involved, right? So while doing that, you're also creating a habit. And the habit that is being created is the habit of doing it anyway, because it feels good. So today I just had like this revelation, like I think I'm beginning to understand this whole mindset around doing the thing that will help you, that you don't really want to do while you're building a habit, and then it becomes a habit. Because today, I just got like super tired all of a sudden. I was like, what did I eat? Was it the sweet cherries? I don't know. Cherries were too sweet today. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> oh, maybe it was. I had some kombucha. I forgot about that. Maybe. And there's no added sugar, but maybe it's the natural sugars in there. I don't know. But either way, I realized today because I was like super tired, but I was just like doing it anyway. And I'm very happy about this. But I realized today that I built a habit of doing it anyway because it's good for me. And now I think I'm beginning to understand this whole, what I call runner's mindset. You know, the people who like get up in the morning and they run five miles a day or whatever they run, um, even on days when they don't feel like it. I think I'm beginning to understand it because you build a habit of just not only doing it, which is what I thought it was initially, you build a habit of, I know this thing is good for me, and I'm just going to do it anyway, even though I don't feel like it. And that's the habit, which is interesting. Because it's like, I just built on top of a layer of what I already thought habit building was. And it's so much more than that. 
So I just wanted to communicate that. I hope I communicated it well. It is a little late, but not too late. It's only like shortly after midnight, 12, 30, half an hour after midnight. Um, so I hope I said that well enough to make sense. There's a habit that you have, that you build, that takes time to build. I would say give yourself uh, a consistent daily 30 days to build the habit. And then after you do that same habit for perhaps another 30 days or perhaps 90 days, do it a little longer, that will make your habit stronger. I know I sound like I'm Dr. Seuss. Do it a little longer. That will make your habit stronger. Okay. <laughs> I'm actually going to write this down. <laughs> Keep reminding myself of this. Um, but the building on the habit is when you, when you just almost like automatic. That's what it is. You, you build a habit of automation where I'm just going to do it because I, I, I know I, it's, it's going to benefit me. And I'm going to do it because I'm in the habit of doing things that benefit me. Bam! Wow. Yes. This is freaking amazing. You know how long I've been trying to get to this point? I'm in a habit of doing things that benefit me. Just for exercise and eating. But there's, you see where this could go? Oh, man. This is like a revelation breakthrough. I'm so happy. Yeah. Okay. So I'll end there. This was a very transformative day for me today. Very transformative. Not only because I'm working toward my goals, but during this process, I'm learning so much about myself and so much about human beings. This is why I don't judge people. I can't judge people because I know the struggle is real. I know how hard things are to achieve and I know how hard it is to change. And if you watch these videos, you'll see it's not always easy. Some days I'm like really struggling. But I realized today I'm in a habit of just doing the thing. And this is probably, I think this is the third time I'm like posting a series of trying to habit build kind of thing. And so, you know, three times a charm, like they say. So, yeah, really um, transformative breakthrough for me today. And I'm, and I'm in a very peaceful and happy state. I was like super happy about it today actually it was interesting and I'm like I guess this is what it's like when you're an athlete or doing something hardcore and you're just like not feeling it on certain days and you just do it anyway it was always like I don't know now I'm con now I'm connected on a this is what I do level instead of this is what I should do or this is what I want to do now I'm connected on a different level like I'm embodied this like this is who I am now this is who I am now so this is I like this. Anyway, I'm about to run out of time. Have a good night. Love and prayers to all of you. Bye.